Hey y'all, I'm Amanda. Welcome back to my channel. In the background here, I have two of my helpers, Penny Lane and Daisy Rain. So, there's no telling what kind of mischief's going to be going on behind me while I'm trying to film this. But I'm excited because I have an unboxing. I don't have any idea what's in this box. One of my subscribers slash friends sent it. They didn't really want to be acknowledged, so we're just going to open it and see what's in here. The only information I have is that it's either... <coughs> Well, I'm pretty sure it's something to eat because, duh, my channel. And, um, is that it's either Japanese type food or from Japan or something. I don't know. Anyway, let's get to open it. I hope all you guys are having a great week. I brought my scissors just in case, so. Okay, don't do that. I also hope the lighting is okay. It is so super gray outside. I've had this box for a couple of days. I haven't had time to film it, but I've been trying to work with the manual settings instead of the auto settings on my camera. So the screen looks pretty true to color, but I don't know. I guess we'll see when I'm uploading it, how it turns out. I'm really excited to see what's in this box. cooking. What is this? So cute and so fun. Do it yourself candy for kids. Well y'all know I'm a big kid. Um and it's sushi. Egg, tuna, and salmon roe. Who's that little guy? Oh my gosh, this is too cute. <laughs> I think what all am I going to need to make this? It says recipe custard, cocoa, vanilla, strawberry, and chocolate flavors. Enjoy making pastries only using the packing pouch as a prep sheet. Girls, enough! So it says I need to wash my hands well. Well, that's already done. And to prepare a glass of water. Okay. And need scissors. Oh, this is going to be so fun, but I think I need a little table. I wonder if I can find something to set this on. Hmm. Hold on, you guys. I'm going to figure this out. But I'm so excited. This is so cute. That's not for you. Oh, my gosh, y'all. I just figured out there's more than one in here. Duh. I didn't even notice that. This first one is the sushi. <gasps> Oh my gosh, look. Little ice cream cones. Y'all, that's so cute. And then this one is, oh my gosh, donuts. Y'all, look. The dogs want it so bad. So, we have three boxes. So, let me go get some water and we'll see which one we're going to make. We probably won't make all of them. But we're definitely going to make one. Do y'all think I'm going to pick the donuts, the sushi, or little ice cream cones? <laughs> Let's see which one might be easier. Oh, the ice cream one looks like it might be very complicated. And the sushi for that matter. Okay, for today's video, I think we're going to have to go with the donuts. They look the easiest for one thing, and they're donuts! So, I still need a glass of water, so let me go get that and I'll be right back. Y'all, do you like my Stevie Nicks inspired shirt? Look at those sleeves. Ooh. <laughs> I'll be right back, y'all. Okay, y'all, I feel like this just turned into an ASMR video, but <laughs> I want you to be able to see. I'm losing light quickly, but I want to go ahead and make these. I think you can see this okay. I just got a pillow propped up here. I'm excited. So inside you have a tray, spoon, squeeze bag, and sugar sprinkles, it says. Why is everything from Japan so much cuter than our stuff? That is so cute. The packaging. Aww. Oh my gosh, and it just gets cuter. Look. Aww. 
Okay, let's see what we got in here. Cocoa dough powder. We've got custard dough powder. The cute little sprinkles yeah. all. Girls, enough. This is the strawberry sauce powder. Huh. Chocolate sauce powder. Vanilla sauce powder. And crumbs. Alright, let's see how we get started. Number one, we're going to make dough. Oh, and I just grabbed a bottle of water. So, fill the round depression with water, then add powder from the yellow packet. Mix by pressing down with the back of the spoon until thick. Yep, there's a little spoon. There's a little, almost like a little piping bag. There's our depression. Is that what it's called? Yes. Okay. The custard does first. I have scissors, but also have teeth. I'm just going to put that much in there for right now. And then if we need more, I'll add more. Because I don't want it to be too much. Okay, so you just stir. Ooh. Oh, this is so cute. I would have loved this when I was a kid. I mean, I love it now, but this would have been everything when I was about eight years old. Use your hands to knead the dough. Divide dough into two equal parts and round each into a ball. Place item on the packing pouch. What is the packing pouch? Oh, it feels so squishy. So I'm just going to knead it like this. There's one. There's two. Okay, so we got the two little vanilla bo dough balls over there. Now it's time to make the chocolate, so we need just a little bit more water. So this is the cocoa dough. I guess it sounds a little chocolatey. This is fun, y'all. Have y'all ever played with these? I think these would be perfect for younger kids, like for Christmas or birthday parties. Oh, now it smells really good and chocolatey. And then form this into two balls. So, we got some white balls and some brown balls. Okay, to make donuts, press the dough balls into donut molds in the tray. Mold and remove donuts. Place them on the packaging pouch. What is this packaging pouch? Oh. <laughs> See, I mess up everything even before I... Yeah, we're going to save this. This is the packaging pouch, duh. The one that I ripped apart and didn't follow the please cut here instructions. That's okay. Packaging pouch saved. Okay, so here are balls over here. <laughs> Don't roll away balls. Okay, now we're going to form our donuts by placing the It wants to try to come apart a little bit, but I can make it work. I can do it. I'm doing it. Oh my gosh, how do you get it out? Stick the little end of the spoon in there. Look, a little donut. Well, it's not perfect, but it'll do. So then we need to do the chocolate one. I'm putting this one in the little flower mold. So it might be shaped like a daisy. Y'all, this is so fun. If you have little kids, or even if you don't, <laughs> you want this for yourself, you should go get it because it is so fun. And probably makes better sense if you're at your kitchen table. <laughs> but the lighting in there is not good so we're in the bedroom making donuts in bed y'all 
Okay, so they're not perfect, but they're pretty cute. Add powder from the red packet to the star. And add a triangle cup. Oh, look, so here's your little measure in the little triangle here. So I guess you can pop that off or cut it. I guess it really doesn't matter. And then you put enough water. This might be the only part that little kids would need help with is the t tiny, tiny measurements. Yeah. Or big kids. This smells very strawberry. This smells good. So, where is this? this? Is a chocolate sauce package. We got a little residue down here. I'm trying to scrape out from my previous mixing. Well, God, I left half the donut in there. This is the chocolate sauce. Y'all, this is so fun. I love this. And I still have the other two packs so I can make sushi next time. And what else? Ice cream cones, I think. I'm going to taste. Oh my gosh. That is really chocolatey. Not bad at all. I'm going to just put, can y'all see this? Some chocolate on this chocolate donut mm. that is so cute I'm going to put a little chocolate one on this one This is so much fun. Okay, I'm gonna make this one strawberry. So I know you said you could use the pouch, but I don't even think you really need it. Just kind of make your own stripes like this. Although it probably would be fun to kind of put it in there. Let's just put the vanilla sauce in there. And cutting the tip off. These are so cute. You can just be so creative. Pink on this one. Use some sprinkles. Oh, it's got little hearts in it, you guys. Why are they so cute? Oh my goodness, y'all, look at that. And don't forget the crumbs. What are these? Chocolate and vanilla little cookie crumbles. Oh, this was so much fun. Can you see those, y'all? 
They turned out so cute. Oh, I'm so excited. My battery's dying. Let me grab another battery. I'll be right back. That was so much fun. I think this would be the perfect gift for any young person or old person. I mean, I had so much fun making those. I think they turned out cute. Now, the only thing left to do now is to test them. Let's try this chocolate one. Mmm. <laughs> Texture's a little interesting, but the flavor is delicious. It tastes a little chocolatey and a little vanilla-y all at the same time. This is the crunch one. The ones we put the crumb on. Mm -hmm. That's so much fun. They are pretty good, actually. This one had crumbs too, but a strawberry glaze. Y'all, these are so fun to make and so good to eat. Mm. Oh, I'm glad I saved this one to last because that strawberry one. Hopefully you're seeing some of that close up. Oh, this is the last bite, y'all. Goodbye, cute donuts. Mmm. Mmm, that one's definitely the best. The vanilla dough with the strawberry icing with the sprinkles for the crunch. Oh, that was my favorite. <sighs> now they're all gone. Y'all, thanks so much for joining me with Poppin' Cooking. Oh, I probably could have used the front for a little decorating inspiration but I still like the way mine turned out so if you'd like to see me do the sushi one and the ice cream cone one let me grab those real quick here's the sushi one and here's the ice cream cone one let me know in the comments down below if y'all would like to see me make these uh, if not I'm still gonna be making them I just don't have to film it I highly recommend these these are so much fun so cute and they taste good and thanks so much to the person who sent these to me. They probably saw these and knew right away this would be something I would love. So, I mean, how can you not love these things? Look how cute they are. Oh my gosh, it makes me wonder how many different kinds they have. Sushi, ice cream cones, and donuts. I'm going to get online and see what else they have. If you want to see me make more of these, let me know in the comments down below. Thanks for joining me this time. I'll see you next time. Bye, guys.